In this video, let's check a number puzzle. And this kind of puzzle is useful for the people who are preparing for interviews. Welcome to Simply Logical. This is Venkatesh. If you are visiting to my channel for the first time, do subscribe to the channel and enable notifications to get updates about our new videos. Let's check the problem now. Given is the set of nine numbers that relate to each other in a certain way. Determine the missing number in the second set. Assume the second set also works in the same way as the first set. Let me repeat the problem. See, given is the set of nine numbers that relate to each other in a certain way. So your task is to find the missing number in the second set. And you have to make an assumption that the second set also works in the same way as the first set. There are four options to this particular problem. The options are 30, 40, 50 and 60. Feel free to pause the video and give a try before checking the solution. Let's everyone know your answer in the comment section. This is a trickier one. First analyze the numbers in first set. The trick is add the numbers in each row and check whether it makes sense. Suppose if it is not making sense, then the second step would be add numbers in the column. But for now, let's add all the numbers in the row and see if we can deduce some kind of relation between the numbers. In set 1, sum of all the numbers in first row is 4 plus 3 plus 4 which is equal to 11. And sum of all the numbers in second row is 5 plus 1 plus 7 equals 13. And sum of all numbers in third row is 4 plus 4 plus 9 which is equal to 17. So is there any relationship between these numbers? Yes, there is an interesting relation here. That is the sum of all the digits in the row is a prime number and the formation goes on like consecutive prime numbers. Hope you know what are prime numbers. The prime numbers are those numbers which are divisible by 1 and by itself. For example, 5 is a prime number because 5 is divisible only by 1 and by itself that is 5. So here 11, 13 and 17 are nothing but the consecutive prime numbers. So let, let us apply the same logic to find the missing number in the second set. In second set, sum of all the numbers in first row is 12 plus 21 plus 28 which is equal to 61. And sum of all numbers in second row is 21 plus 12 plus 34 which is equal to 67. So now 61 and 67 are consecutive prime numbers and the next prime number after 67 is 71. So the equation to find the missing number in third row becomes 17 plus 14 plus x equals 71. After solving this equation, x is equal to 40. Thus missing number is 40. So if you know the logic, it becomes easy to find the solution. So this is a kind of pattern you have to practice before actually going to the interview. That's all for this video. Let me know if you have any questions. I will try to address as soon as possible. If you are looking for the similar problems, then check out the description for the details. Thanks for watching the video and thank you for your support.